Hey guys, welcome to the Retro Gaming Junction. This is Camilio, and we're continuing our game of Lure of the Temptress. So I did a little bit of research on this game. I actually watched a couple of reviews, and the reviews are a bit all over the place. Like, I feel that some people are not super honest. Like, I've I've watched a lot of honest review that say this game isn't the best. And there's a lot of people that seems to excuse a lot of things just because, I don't know, they like the game. They played it when they were young. They think it looks good or everything. But, I mean, yeah, bullshit is bullshit. You have to, like, it's not because you like something that you can't see the faults in it. And this is a recurring theme. And uh, more so recently with people. Like, I don't care about saying bad stuff about Deus Ex or System Shock or, or Gabriel Knight or The Dig or Sam and Max. I, I don't have much to say bad about them. There's not, there's not much bad about them. Uh, how does this work? Is this the exit? What the fuck is the exit? Isn't this the exit? Excuse me. Uh, but the ScumVM version has problems, which is kind of stupid because this game is not only given on GOG. Is this the, the entrance? I'm so confused. Just talk. Let's talk to her. I don't know. He's gonna fuck around a bit. So yeah, the DOS version has some problem. Like everybody mentions the pathfinding. Everybody mentions the fact that um the the conversation, like all the problems I had. Uh yeah, most of the people mentioned them. <laughs> oh my god. But this like not finding where to go is definitely a scum VM thing, it seems. We know about the dragon. Fishing should do now. Did I did I save after the Oh no, I didn't restore the right game. This is the right one. Yeah, after I uh, talking to him. Now I think he's asleep or something. How do we get out of here? <laughs> he doesn't respond. So now I think we should be able to get out. store yeah I've seen the dragon will he help us he has given me an object of great power which he says will be useful then we must get back in town, to town immediately. Perhaps Lutheran will have some idea of how to get into the castle. What do you know of Selena? She was appreciated, appreciated, apprent, apprenticed. Oh.
You're a brave man, stranger, but you'll not get to Selena until you find a way to outwit the skull who guard her. You wait till you're my age, you'll get a senior citizen's concession pass issued by Turnvale Council and don't get much use of mine. They're a very good idea. I don't trust those modern processed foods. Not food, the woman's name. Bah, full of preservative. Selena, what kind of reference are they making there? Oh, a lot of them mention these corridors here, this place here. Which you've not seen me go here a lot because there's no reason to go there. That screen connects to another screen which connects back here. So... And this connects to another useless place. It's not even a shortcut. It's literally useless. Oh, you let me get into the castle. You're joking. That's the last place I'd want to visit. But I'll give you some advice. What is that? Keep your eye on the skull patrols. There's one that particularly was acting most suspiciously. Okay. Oh, wait, wait, wait. You might talk to me here. I'll go in there. I, I'll have to pay to... Get some information. Help me get into the castle. I go home soon, too busy packing. Don't worry, you kill Selena easy. I wish I had your confidence. Old Tar wish she had longer holiday. How do you turn the skulls without any help? It's easy, it's easy. Brain boxes, turn them, door open up. <laughs> yeah. Will you help me, help me get into the castle? Well, I'm not sure if it will work for you, but I usually hang into the castle gate when the score patrol go off duty. Perhaps I better try another way. Please, yourself. It's easy though. I never have to wait long before the score come. See if we can. Uh... No, no, no. Just go after him. I like to tell the score about you. Oh, great! You're, you're great. Is that all? Don't go there. Why are you so determined to risk your life at every opportunity? The fate of Turnvale means a lot to me too, but not as much as your own life. You mean you care for me? Of course I do, idiot. If you hope for a romantic scene, then you're talking to the wrong woman. I must be crazy. I don't even know your name, but I love you. Have you lost your tongue? 
I I don't know what to say. Look, take your time, think it over. If you feel any affection for me at all, you know where to find me. I can't stop. I can't stop now, I'm afraid. Oh no, she was talking to the people. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You can't go rushing in there. The place is full of squirrels. The only humans in there, apart from Selena, are the children she uses. One by one, they disappear into the castle, never to be seen again. Now they've taken. And it's on slow speed. Slow text. What happens if I remove that? Uh oh. Oh. Wait, this was longer. This is better. I have more time to read now. That's so stupid. What the fuck? I admire, I admire ambition in one so lowly born. I sup. Okay, I guess I don't have the time to read. Do you mean to imply for employment, sir? I think you'll have a problem there. So that's plenty of. Okay. Where's Rat Pouch? Okay,
But if I want to talk to these guys, I have to be in there. Let's talk to you. There's a skull that's supposed to be suspicious. Sure, I can talk to. Let's follow him. I can, but I hope you find a way in because I hate you. I don't know, the first time I saw you come in, uh, lay eyes on you. Oh, we can't even have this conversation again? I want to read it again. I'm the voice of your conscience. <laughs> I got one. Yeah. Will you help me get in the, guess in the castle? Will you repeat? I can't, but I hope you find a way in, because I hate you. I don't know why, but the minute I set eyes on you, I hated you. Well, who are you, anyway? I am the voice of you. I am Dear Mont, and I plan to overthrow the school. Now that explains it. I always hated self-appointed individual. Your bigotry is exceeded only by your grossness. Ha. Huh. Oh, she won't talk to us. It's not a place for... Oh, no, I asked a question. I don't even ask for... A, for a beer, I guess. I need to open the door. No, I can't really talk to them. They just say shut up.
I think I talked to everybody. Oh, except the monks. They're the most annoying to talk to. Keep an eye on scroll patrol. Uh, I'm probably just going to look it up at this point. Yeah, fuck it. Town. Walk around the town to find Malin. Talk to him and you will mention the score guard is acting suspiciously. Go to the marketplace. Wait for the guard to enter shop and then look through the window. Like here, you can look through this window. No. I said go in there, but I want to see through it anyway. Go in there. And wait till someone enters, I think. Wait for the guard to enter shop. That clock sound is appropriate. Shit, and you would have to wait for this to happen? This is ridiculous. The fuck? Uh, while we wait, let's see another walkthrough. Uh, talk to Gowen, go to the forge, talk to Lutern, then talk to Melin. Tell you about the score. Go to the marketplace, and when you see score going to village shop, look through window. Hmm. Yeah, go to the marketplace. Yeah, go here. And I, we've been around here a lot, and I've never seen... Well, I've seen the a scroll enter that building before. Uh, but it's been a while since I've seen it. It's crazy because I saw him go there a bunch of times. It seems that now that I want him to go there, of course it won't happen.
Wow. I don't know, let's move around a little bit. Following him was a good idea. I don't understand why he didn't enter the the market when I was following him. <sighs> he, he doesn't enter it anymore. He did it at the beginning of the game, but now he doesn't. He saw me go through the window, like look in the window. <laughs> and maybe he's there now. No, no, he's right there. No, no. <sighs> There's so many people. I I'm trying to go like the move, and I can't. <laughs> Shit, we need to save this. Give me more food. That's the fourth this this week. What are the rest of us supposed to eat? If we need food, if not potatoes and man flesh, score must be fed. We have to eat too, you know, life goes on despite Selena and you score. We're all hungry. This is a happy thriving community before you come along. <laughs> what the fuck? All that will change. What do you mean? Skull can't reach Selena. She is guarded by magic, and Skull have no power against that. We need your help, human. I don't see how we can help you. Silence. Later you hide in battle, and I will take you into the castle. Kill Selena, and I might spare you when the flesh need is upon me. Just a minute, Wayne. Come back. A mounting excitement grips you as you pound through the conversation you have overheard. You realize that this could be a chance to infiltrate the castle. Get into a barrel? Do I need to talk to that guy now? To the squirrel? Well, the squirrel's not there. He's not there anymore. He just disappeared. That's not virtual theater. Let's confront this guy. I will take your place in the battle. I don't understand. I overheard your conversation with the squirrel. So I don't have to enter the castle? No. And I don't have to face Selena? No. Quickly, here comes the scroll. Climb into the barrel. Which one? Okay. Well, that's a lot of nice little graphics here.
Okay, let's save here. 45. We're in the uh, cellar. The wooden cask is empty. The wooden cask is empty. Ask, give, talk to. Don't be frightened, boy. I ain't frightened, just surprised. What is your name? I'm Minnow. What are you doing here? I need to get into the tower, boy. My master's the gatekeeper, a big squirrel. He's been drinking all day. You won't be you won't get past him. I'm the official ale and wine taster. I've come to take you home. I'm going to help you escape. I've come for some dinner. Let's go with this first. I went brown yesterday. I've come to take you home, boy. I'd rather work for school. Me? I'm going to tell a master you. Okay. No, 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 don't do that. Please don't. Ah, oh, shit. Okay. <laughs> that wooden cask is empty. Is this the same thing? I can't even right click these things. There's a door there. Here I can only interact with this one. Oh, is that bad? She is upstairs, but you'll... Oh, oh. Oh, this one is different. She won't like that. Tell the squirrel there's someone in the cellar. Tell the squirrel there's another sentry. I'll be able to climb stairs. Okay. You can interact with the bong. Pull. Okay. Get. No. Use. A uh, knife. Use. Broken glass. I'm going to try a lot of stuff. Maybe not. Let's try everything. Fuck it. Just in case. The, the flask. The diary. Yeah, that's going to do it. <laughs> Use the statue. Use the sprig. What is the sprig? What the fuck is the sprig? 
I have get rendered. You search your pocket for the magic stone, the cavern surface cold and rough in your grasping fingers. But suddenly you remember the dragon's warming and snatch your hand away. Uh, maybe I need to use that only at a certain time. Sprig. The sprig of herbs is dry. Oh, yeah, yeah. Hmm. Okay, let's save. Oh, there's a fucking yes, coral that arrives here. Maybe it's because I talked to this dude. The raw and bloody remains of an unidentifiable animal lie partly butchered on the huge table. Greasy wedges of fat hang from the unhealthy looking flesh. I can't right click on it. Tongs. The tongs are bent and twisted from age and are probably used to move hot coals and from the range. To and from the range. I get I got them. The long knife has a blade which glints with menace. A sort of weapon which could rip through the leathery skin of a scroll with ease. Yeah, don't don't get it. I can't get it. The giant ladle looks as if it, it looks as if it could have been used as part of the siege engine on which you played as a child. The enormous iron pot has a vast capacity in order to cook for the guards and servants who maintain the great castle in the former days. Range. The cooking range is black with constant use and gives off an enormous heat, which prevents you from getting too close. And I can't interact with that either. Can I interact with the pot? What about the range? No. Use utensil. The utensil has no obvious use. It could be part of a rat trap or maybe a device for skinning marshmallows. Marshmallows in two words like that? <laughs> but it's unlike anything you've ever seen before. And I cannot right click on it. This pan is surprisingly small, almost delicate compared to the scale of all the other cooking tools in the kitchen. The inner surface is smooth as silk and gleams with oil, and years of careful use. It could only have been the Ed Chef's omelette pan. And I can't right click it. The boy is pale and thin with a mop of tangled hair falling over his brow. His skinny arms and legs bear the marks of many bruises, both old and new. I can't right click this. I can go there. Fat. The large flap of fat is yellow and white with semi-translucent fronds. fronds. It seems to quiver obscenely in the flickering firelight. Ew. I can get it. As your hand closes on the particularly rancid piece of fat, you shiver with revulsion. With, with your teeth clenched and your eyes closed, you tear it from the carcass. Do we get it? That. The fat has warmed in the heat of your hands, coating your palms and fingers with an evil smelling greasy deposit. Ach. Cheers. 
shit, this place is, this place is big. No, I don't want to talk to you. I don't trust you, man. Wait, wait, wait. Surprise, like... motherfucker! Hey, Eric. Uh, it doesn't seem like there's anything interactable here. Hmm. Okay. Uh, let's go in. Fuck it. Let's see what happens. Who the hell is that? Me, dear Mont. Oh. Fuck it. Let's go. We did it. I'm sure you would have touched me in. So they don't give a shit. Look at that guy. <laughs> Look at okay. Actually, the game is cool just because of this scene here. This these two scenes here. Yeah, these animations are really nice. This this whole thing here is very good job. Okay, what the fuck? get that ever appears to be connected to the winch mechanism look at winch the cogs of the wooden winch are worn away with age and continual use get operate the winch won't move use uh, whew. thumbs, use, axe, I don't know, use, no, uh, pull, did I try to pull? Seems to be jammed or rusted. Oh yeah, we'll use the fat, I know this puzzle. You slap the slippery handful of grease around the rust encrusted lever. Okay, let's save. Pull. Um, oh shit, what the fuck did that do? Yeah. Is because I use that? Let's wait. Let's see if he actually comes in. It's like it's not connected or anything, right? Oh. Okay, it's not because I use that. Yeah, it's like it's missing a part here. I think I used the axe, the, the, the tongue, this, not the spring. Okay, can I just avoid him or what's the deal here? Oh. There you go. I thought this was something I could open because he was sitting on this. Ah, he's coming. Ah, get out of the way, dude. Shit, dude, get out of the way. Okay, he's staying in this area. Uh, I don't know, let's go here. Let's go up there.
Oh, okay. The massive head is moth-eaten and straw bulges from its poorly stitches seams. Yet the strength and dignity of the noble animal prevails and defiance of the barbarous fool who brought it crashing to the forest floor. That was well, well written. Okay. Yeah, okay. So, yeah, this is where you need to go to put this thing down. That's a really nice scene right there. I would have put that, uh, like, in the uh, behind the box. I don't know what scene they used behind the box. Let's see, I'm, I'm actually curious. You want to sell this game on its looks. <laughs> There's nothing else. I think in covers here. Yes, I have the back screen. So the back screen is one of the intro scene with a blue background and like a bunch of horses shadowy figures in the intro and then you have the second screen is the punching screen then the fourth screen is one of the town screen in front of the the pub and then the other one is inside that pub that's that's what they chose wow that is not what a, what i would have chosen i would have chosen either this even though like this is the end of the game so maybe maybe the dragons you want to show the dragon i mean the dragon it's cool to have it on the box so okay we're going back Can't right click any of these things. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. I can avoid it. Just avoid the guy. Yeah, come for me. Uh oh. Shit. Oh. Uh, I don't have to go back up anyway. Like, I don't even know where this was. No, this guy is just following us all the time. not the best I maybe mean, I can ask him <laughs> fuck ah uh, what's this one oh if I activate it like does it does something but it really doesn't do anything these things don't seem to move this doesn't seem to be turning this is when i entered yeah this is very much at the beginning but we didn't get anything else there's a fat here we know what to do with that wait it doesn't even what i need to look at the carcass first i 
Yeah. Huh. Let's get this. Oh yeah, okay. I wanna try the tongues. I'll try the tongues on, on this thing here. On the bong. There's so many so few things you can interact. I wanted to use the tongues on the on the pods or something. We can't even right click on those things. Wine now spills from the cask. Yay! Is this good? I don't know. Where should I save this? 49 wine. Yeah. Uh, can we get the wine? Again, I can't even interact with the wine itself. Like blood from a gaping wound. I can't even click the cask now. Okay, maybe it's gonna do something when that guy comes in. The squirrel. He eventually comes in anyway. I think. I, I don't I shouldn't tempt the let's talk to this guy. Now. That plan of yours was useless. What now? The elder skull is a leaky cask in the cellar. Tell us to all there's someone in the cellar. How can I get rid of a scroll? And it's drink. Well, exactly. Okay, like your father. Yeah. Okay. Icky cask. I'll be right mad if things swine is going to be waste. Is he gonna do that? <laughs> That's it. There's no more wine. It actually ended. I can't believe it. I for some reason I thought it would just go away. Wherever. Because in games that's usually what that what's happened. It like they just you open up a faucet and well a faucet that's normal. I don't know, I didn't expect it to end. So <sighs> I'm not even sure the boy will do what I ask him to do. Did he what, what did you do it, dude? Oh, okay. Oh, he's coming. Oh, he's coming right for me. No, he is not. He's going for the gasket. Okay, cool. But, I don't know. What, I'm not sure this works. Out of my way, you little brat. Yeah, he's just coming for me now. Okay. Uh, I don't know what to do. I think it wasn't fast enough with the my with the wine spill thing. I also don't know how to open up that gate. Is there anything to interact here with? Ah. I use the fat on the winch instead. Ah, uh, this guy, as soon as he's gonna touch us, we die. Oh. 
what's he doing? Does he also have some pathfinding problems? Probably. No, that didn't work, right? And I don't have anything else except axe. Says the lever appears to be connected to the winch mechanism. No, it doesn't appear to be connected to the winch mechanism. Okay, let's go back to wine spill and let's maybe be faster with bringing the guard in. Oh my god. Like I'm looking for the guy here to talk to when what's his name? I don't care. No, oh, that's that's him. Now it takes so long. Uh oh. I thought he was going for me, but I guess he is. He's just stupid. <sighs> oh, but before the wine spill is these, which are... I need to go back here. Okay, I need to talk to that little boy when he's here. Just after I do the, the spill spilling wine. So let's talk to him so he stops. What now? Uh or whatever. Should I save again over this? Oh, whatever. Oh, let's uh, let's hide here. What then? Can we... we... We need to make that fucking winch thing work. Okay, should be coming with the score, right? 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 Come on! Ah, oh, shit! Oh. Okay! Oh, fuck. Ah, yeah, fuck it. I'll just look it up. Take the fat, take the thing, tell someone the seller, west to the wine seller, look at the cask, 
Use the tongue and the bong, walk behind the post at the top right and wait for Skull to enter room. And then there's another paragraph. Should I just read it? <sighs> After the Skull start drinking from the cask. Okay, okay. We'll see, we'll see. I'm just tempted to just read exactly what to do. There's really not much to do. Uh, the, the wine spill. Yeah, that's that was okay. And he, the boy's gone. So I would go behind, what, this pillar? <laughs> like that? One behind the post in the top right corner. I mean, this is a good spot. Somebody recording themselves peeing and putting in the game. I thought it was really funny. I love that my my one pixel nose is sticking out. Oh, there you go. He's coming. He's coming. Oh, he's coming. Oh, he stops. This is different. So he's supposed to drink from it. Sorry, sir. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, that was funny. <laughs> Not well. This is funny, but the 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 way he snapped there, kind of glitched there. That was that was funny. Okay, so can we interact with him now? We can look at him. He is ugly even by Skoral standards. You recognize him as the guard who has taunted and tortured you in the dungeon. Really? That's the one? What a disgusting sight. Oh well, I don't need to worry about him anymore. Okay, maybe I can talk to you now. How do I get to Selena? She lives upstairs. We have to lower the drawbridge. How? I don't know. I just want to get out before the skull wake up. A tail. Unlock, return, use. Something that I don't know. <laughs> You're funny. Is that part of my inventory? Examine. No. Ask. Operate. Operate. That doesn't work. Tell me no to operate. Oh. Pull nothing. Push nothing. Return nothing. That thing almost seemed optional because I was able to avoid them anyway here. The real problem I have is making this work. So use fat. Like if you look at it, this appears to be connected.
Oh, do you need to... Oh, okay, I need to unlock it. Okay, I will need... Uh, I'll, I'll need to ask the guy to do that. And then operate this. Right? Like, this is a thing that turns around like that. This is a, this is a locking mechanism. Okay, he's right there. Uh, it'd be nice if he would follow me. Tell to uh, pull the lever. Finish? Oh, he's gonna be stupid here. Whew. If he succeed in talking to this guy, it's gonna be amazing. Come on, you can do it. Oh, wow, you did it. Follow these instructions. All right. Okay, then I need to be fast, I guess. Come on. I want to get there before him. And don't fuck him around too much, because if he's, he doesn't know what to do, he's going to get stuck. He's not coming, which is not a good sign. Say it worked, and let's wait. I don't know, move there. Uh, shit. He needs to come with us, like inside that room. That would be so much easier. He's still hanging there. Tell to return, finish. Oh my god. It should be should be following us. He's stuck there, completely broken. <laughs> what the fuck? Oh, what, I shouldn't have talked to him there? Tell to... Let's do something else. Uh... I don't know. Get. <laughs> All right. Ah, oh, come on. I seem to have stuck him there. I'm pretty sure that's what you need to do. I'm not 100% sure. Seems logical. Um, if I reload this. Okay, he's not there. Where is he? Okay, let's tell him here. Tell. Oh, I can go to. 
oh, I can't tell him to go there because we haven't been there yet. Let's say kitchen is going to stay there, stay here probably. I'm going to go deliver, come back here. Oh, come on. You're right there. Is he going to the kitchen? The cellar? He is. <laughs> wow. Can't move. I can't save on this. I don't know. It was stuck in the save anyway. Oh, this won't work. Use the fat. Oops, let's save again. Because that dude is in front of the door. Ah, <laughs> oh, come on! Ta -da. <sighs> so, like, I'm stuck here now? Wow. Says are not good then if that guy is stuck there. Okay. Okay, I I'll let him move around. I, I need to go to the right, go get to that place. And if he stays there, it's fine. Okay, save. I I don't know anymore. Use the fat. Just pull it, just so that we know that we can pull it.
Oh, he's coming. He's coming. Look, he's actually following us. Excellent. Wow, I thought he was about to do it. No. Talk to you. Tell. To pull. Lever. Finish. Oh no, I need to go there to tell them. That's the beauty of this game. Just telling him like that, like that is not enough. He needs to go there and tell him. And now he's so close. I need to be fast here. No! <laughs> what the fuck? Oh my god, this is this is gonna be fun. Oh yeah. Pull the lever. And then pull the lever. I could tell him to pull the lever six times. He can't even get near him to talk to him. Okay. Alright. Operate. No. Oh, almost. And then pull the lever again, and then pull the lever again, and then pull the lever. Like that, it should be enough. Finish. Maybe I'm going to do the opposite. I oh, don't know. Operate. Oh, wow. The record. Whoa! Shit! Fucking did it. Uh oh. By doing that, no one's not going to come back? <laughs> well, this is working. Yeah, well, that, I'm, I'm happy to see that it actually worked if I didn't, if I wasn't able to do it the first time. Okay, so this probably lowered the bridge. I would think so. We're going to take a little break and I'm going to see if that bridge is lowered in a couple of minutes. Stay tuned.
Uh, is he gonna follow me? Oh shit. Oh fuck, your progress is barred by the appearance of a huge beast. Instinctively, you draw and brandish your weapon. Oh shit, I can't go back to go save. Okay, well last time this worked well. Eh? What? What is this? I'm able to hit him here. What is... <laughs> what the fuck? I don't care if this was broken or not. <laughs> it was just funny. Let's save. Ah, this game. Okay, so yeah. This game is like, they give it on GOG. But they also give it on ScumVM. This was actually the first game that ScumVM... I think ScumVM now gives other games. But I think back in the day, like more than 10 years ago, you would go on ScumVM site and you could just download... This was like a, a game that you could try the ScumVM engine in. At least that's the way I saw it. I think a lot of people saw it like that way. And a lot of people played the GOG version which run in ScumVM, even though you go into the comments, you go into the review, like everybody knows that the ScumVM version is shit. It's been years and years and years. It would have been easy um, for GOG at least to fix it or even ScumVM to fix it. I don't understand. Because at this point in time, way more people have played the ScumVM GOG giveaway version than the original version no doubt and that's the version like the, the the version that is given on gog right now is totally gonna be the version that people will remember or will be that's the def unfortunately that's the definitive version of, of this game right now which is quite sad but the developers themselves gave it away, so it's their problem. Oh, okay. I thought it was getting naked for us. What's happening? Can we do something here? What? Is this just a cutscene? What the And so the, the game is over. And so the town of Turnvale was freed from Selena's evil tyranny. The skull remained, but eventually they became part of the everyday routine of the sleepy town. Morcus was driven from the, the town in disgrace, while his son Menal was apprenticed to Lutern. Uh, Menal was the son of Morcus. Oh, okay. I was reading fast because I, I didn't know if I had... Oh, you don't even see this. Well, there's nothing, but it's just text. And my fair Gowen, she grew plump and content with babies. I sometimes imagine the surprise on the faces of Nelly, Ratty and all my friends where I visit them at, at the Magpie Tavern. But that chapter of my life is closed now. When Lutern and Gowen were led, I left Turnvale perhaps forever. This is not the first time that's come VM. For some reason, some things don't are not captured. It makes no fucking sense. You're not missing anything here. But that's the reason I restarted. When the intro did the same thing and I noticed it. And on the Twitch VOD, you'll see it, but you might not see it on the YouTube because I cut it out. There's nothing going on. It's still the text of, and my fair go in. She grew plump and content with babies. The game is over. And you can't even see it. I'm gonna try to show you with uh, maybe window capture. There you go. Boom. So that's what you would have you're supposed to see is this. Let's see if there's something else. Enter. And no. <laughs> and that's my scum VM library. And it's an early, it's a recent bill. I mean, the 2023 December. Uh, right now, it's uh, it's March 2024. But 
Whatever. I don't. I don't understand. I don't understand why this game is so broken and why the developer would give give away this game. No, like, do they know that it's broken? <laughs> anyway, it's done. It was okay. It's not the worst. Well, it may be the worst point and click adventure game I ever finished. I ever played? Maybe not. Maybe not. But it's not up there. It's... It's definitely not up there. I'd say a couple of the King's Quest, maybe King's Quest 1 and 2 were worse than this, but those were so old and they're parser. Like if, if I think about games that look like this, that has this aesthetic of like 19, early 1990s, uh, 320 by 200 pixel art, like uh, Monkey Island 1 and 2, um, most of the LucasArts games and a bunch of the Sierra games. This is not like this is in terms of a lot of things. <laughs> the gameplay, the puzzles, nothing was up to par. So we're going to play the next game is going to be uh, Star Trek, uh, the next generation, Klingon, Honor Guard, it's a first-person shooter using the Unreal Engine, and it might have come out like, like Unreal came out. In what the fuck is it too complicated? What the fuck? The game Unreal, the game. Yeah, I know 1998. First release, May 1998. And this may have come out before. No, October of 98. Uh, but still, this is the early, this is very, very, very early 3D game. Um, but it is very well received. I almost bought this game. Um, I remember back in the day, it was in a computer store. The box was there. There's a bunch of games like that. That there's there's a what if I would have bought it. Uh, this is one of them. Um, Outpost from Sierra is one of them. I also wanted to buy um, the box, the the Space Quest Collector's box. It was a huge box. Like it was like three boxes wide and fucking huge thing just because i was a big fan of of uh, space quest but i i had already space quest uh, six i had uh, space quest five which was given to me which i think i have the box here but the box is in so poor condition um so i was ah oh, it was the use it was more than a hundred bucks and back then i didn't have much money i still don't have much money but i was ah oh, no i can't buy that it was not it's not responsible but Klingon Honor Guard, um, just because I wasn't to that first-person, story-driven game set. And this might have been 99. Like, I don't think that when I wanted to buy this, it was when it came out. It might have been like a couple of months afterwards. Maybe because the game was at a lower price and I was tempted. The only reason I didn't get it is because... I didn't know anything about Star Trek. So I was like, oh, I, I it looks cool, but I don't know anything about Star Trek. So if I play this, I, I won't know what's going on. Um, but I should have I should have tried it out. And maybe that would have been my entrance into the, the Star Trek. Because I was watching TNG back then, but I was never really a big fan of Star Trek until now. About like three years ago when I started watching the original series, every single episode of the original series. Um, yeah. And this is a very well-reviewed game, so it's probably going to be a good uh, good old first-person shooter uh, thing. Uh, and after that, we're finally going to come back to Zork. It's been a while, but uh, yeah, we're finally going to finish the Zork uh, saga with uh, Zork uh, Grand Inquisitor. Which I had the box here. 
I haven't played that game since I played it out of that box. Um, so not knowing if it would have been a, like really troublesome to make it work, I bought it recently on GOG just to be sure. Even though like that's kind of stupid. Now that I know with what I know with like the Temptress, like GOG is cool and all, but they're not perfect and. Like, I wouldn't buy... I shouldn't buy a game that I already own. I should at least try the CD and see if I can make it work. But I would have to, like, look up if there's patches and all that stuff. Um, yeah. Let's raid somebody. Trade Cherokee Starfish. Thanks for watching, everyone. Have a great night. See you next time. Uh, tomorrow we're playing more um, Icewind Dale, probably uh, starting a little later, like uh, this stream at something like 9, but probably finishing later than usual. Trying to do that three hour stream. Thanks for watching, everyone. Have a great night. Ciao. Thank you for your cooperation. Good night. I'll buy that! <laughs>